were the other members of the Mexicals like to work with? Super crazy, psychosis, difficult to work with, or a hoobie? Uh, psychosis. Uh, I, I had lots of matches with that guy, and he is one of the sweetest dudes. Uh, very, very giving in his matches. He even comes up with spots for you to, you know, to to hit on him and stuff. And you know, he's he's a really, really good guy too, man. And uh, super crazy. That's my boy. <laughs> Me and super crazy go way back from ECW, man. And, and super crazy and I had a lot of matches yeah. in ECW, and uh, he helped. He was one of the guys, I mean, that was in that line of helping make, you know, get me over whenever Paul made that decision to to start elevating me in ECW. Super crazy was one of my angles, you know, so I had a good uh, run with him for almost a year. Uh, I think Psychosis came in there quite a few times, I, and anytime he came in, I always worked him. Hoovy is a good worker, don't get me wrong. I, I love Hoovy. Hoovy's funny as shit to me, you know what I'm saying? When I yeah. see Hoovy... I just look at Hoovy as like, ah, oh, Hoovy. You know, I mean, he's just that guy. Yeah. But wrestling him, I've, I never did have a great experience. I mean, we had good matches, don't get me wrong, even though we never really got to the point of calling anything because he did, was just always doing this or doing that, and we only had a few minutes to call shit. But we would throw shit together, and I'm the kind of guy that, you know what, if you're not going to talk to me, we're going we're gonna to work. Yeah. We're just going to work. And we'll walk and talk. And if you're cool with that, then that's fine. If you can't do that, then I'm going to chop you from one end of that place to the other, you know, yeah. and stretch you and beat on you. But Hoovy's a tough little bastard. Hoovy <laughs> will give it back. He really will. Yeah. And uh, I appreciate that about him. And I always respected him about that. You know, it's just hard calling a match because his, in my opinion, you know, and, it's, and I'm not talking bad about the kid. I love him. I think in his mind, you know, he was uh, put over a little bit more than what uh, he's uh, believing. Oh, yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah. Um, I think he really think, because uh, back in WCW, man, he really thought that he was the juice. He thought, <laughs> he, was, no, he thought he was on the level of the rock, man. And he would tell you. He would tell you. For real. For real. He thought he was on the level of the rock big time, man. Fuck. Yeah. I mean, and. But everybody back then just was like, ah, Hoovy. Right, <laughs> you right, know? right. So I don't right. know. I, I see some uh, stuff on uh, Instagram about him and uh, that he puts He's still out. working, man. He great. He's still oh, working. Yeah. Still I've seen, uh, seen a couple of clips of his matches, and he's still doing the, the same high-flying shit, man. I don't, and he looks young. I don't know if he's got a good doctor down there or something. or if it's, Well, yeah, there's, there's pharmacies, you know. <laughs> you can get whatever you want down there, you know.